today we're going to talk about VRQ Bucks. So if you received a VRQ Bucks gift card that looks like this, flip it over and you'll see on the back of it a credit card number as well as a pin. Now once I have that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my dashboard. I'm going to go to balance and then I'm going to click load gift card and this will track all gift cards that you've had in the past. So let's click load. Now I'm going to enter the gift card number. I'm going to enter the pin. And then I'm going to select load gift card. All right, so my total balance is 50. Now I can go out and I can nominate with that gift card amount. And here's what that looks like. I'm gonna click on make nomination. Find an event. Defaulted to bareback. I'm gonna select which athlete. I'm gonna select the performance just like normal. And the segment I'm looking at. And that's gonna create the, bring up this new screen where you normally enter your coupon code. Underneath of that, you'll actually see gift card. Now it actually tells you how much you have in gift cards in your account. And you basically just apply how much you want to. You could apply 25, you can apply 50, but Applying 50 will then reduce it from your overall amount once it is actually finalized. So it hasn't taken it away at this point, but it's showing you that the nomination for this was a, a Division One, the transaction fee uh, for the WCRA, and a subtraction of $50, which was the gift card amount that you actually utilized. If you guys have any further questions about VRQ Bucks or anything else, please contact us at support at wcrarodeo.com and we'll respond very quickly. Good luck at your next event and I hope that you can be our next Triple Crown winner. The WCRA is super excited about the Triple Crown and what it's adding to the world of rodeo. Guys, have a great day and let us know how we can help.